Hi everybody, it's Philly from Created and Curated here. It's another Christmas video and we are going to be making some Christmas presents. So my 12 year old makes the best Christmas presents ever. She is really, really good at making things and she really enjoys doing it as well and giving it to people as gifts. So this year she's decided that she's going to do candles in mugs. Trust me, it's gonna look good. We thrifted some mugs from the charity shop. I think we got six for a fiver. Um, uh, they were actually cups and saucers rather than mugs. Um, she's drawn some little bits on them with Sharpie and now we're going to uh, melt some wax and put it in. So I thought I would show you. So here are her little mugs. Are oh, they brilliant? And she's done some Christmas trees and she's done different colors on them. We were thinking whether we needed to um, bake them in the oven in order to get the Sharpie to stay on, but because they're candles and they're not gonna be going through the dishwasher or anything, then I think it will be fine. So now we are going to melt the wax. We have some pre-waxed wicks, <laughs> pre-waxed wicks, um, which we need to stick down into the bottom of the cup. And we are using uh, paraffin wax pellets. They won't judge. We know we should be using soy, but that was all they had at the shop and we needed to get it done quickly. So ta-da! So far we've put three cups worth in here, um, which seems to be quite a lot. And then we're going to put some water in here and then melt it really, really slowly and then pour it. Oh, I forgot to mention, we've got some essential oils to go in there as well. I might double check whether you can put essential oils in there. We'll see. Right. Slowly melting, slowly melting, nearly there. Right, adding in the essential oils. You can have rosemary or ylang ylang. Which one do you want? Ylang ylang. Ylang ylang ylang. Go on then, put some drops in. Let me take that. Really drops, just so you want to shoot. Well, like 10. 10? <laughs> yeah. And Radovax has only put a nil oven on, so sorry. Bum, bum. Oh, look at this, though. That already smells nice. Does it? Brilliant. And then we're going to pour it in. Oh, And then next one. Please don't do that. It's not communion. <laughs> Brilliant. Do you think we're going to have enough to do a third one? Or should no, we have to do a second can, or? We can yeah. try. Go on then. So pop what we've got in. Ta-da! All of the candles lined up in a row. Uh, we've got to leave them to set overnight. As you can see, that one's only just been done. Um, they're looking pretty solid. I think they're probably going to um, dip a bit, but that's okay because that's all part of it being homemade. They do suggest to do a second pour, and I've got enough. So we'll see if Madam lets me do it while she's at school tomorrow. Nope. We'll see. <laughs> right, I'll be back in the morning. I've done her second pour for her. So they look like that. We just need to cut the wicks down. And those are her little decorations. Let me see if I can grab another one. Don't they look brilliant? So for what, a couple of pounds for the mugs and then like a tenner overall for the wicks and the wax. She's got herself six Christmas presents. I hope whoever is receiving them, I hope it's not me, uh, enjoys them and sees all the love and care that she's put into them. Okay, thanks guys. I'll see you again soon, hopefully for another Christmas video. Bye.